Okay, this is a short tutorial on capturing a Google Slides presentation or perhaps a PowerPoint through OBS after you've already set it up. So in my last tutorial, we set up OBS and got it prepared to capture your desktop. In this one, we're going to actually take you through the short process of capturing it without editing. Now that's going to present a little problem at the start because you're going to get the infinity screen here. Um, without editing, you can't cut that out. That's a different process. But if you keep this short, um, there won't be much of that on there at the beginning or the end. So notice I have my screen up. I hit start record, which I've already done here. Um, and then I pull up my screen, whatever I want. So I got my copyright and fair use screen up here. That's pretty much all I do. I hit present. And I go through the, the process. This is a one slide. This was meant so I can go through when I get to the end. Um, after, say, 10 slides, 20 slides. While I'm talking through there, I hit exit. And it takes me back to this. Hit minimize. And I hit stop record. Mm -hmm. Once I do that, it's saved to my folder that I created in the last video. I can then take that video and I can upload it to YouTube. Uh, there are ways in YouTube to trim the beginning and the end if you want this infinity screen off. Uh, just remember to give yourself some time while talking if you want to do that. Uh, some people just put these out there, they upload them, whatever. Um, it's up to you. Uh, it's kind of a, a rush time. You're learning this process. Uh, video editing this is not difficult. You trim the start and the end. But some of you don't have the software to do that, and that's where this is going to help. Just put the video out there. Mainly, all you're going to do is pull this program up, minimize it, and then it records your desktop. There's Lord Vader. Whatever I open up over here, it's going to record. If I open up PowerPoint or Premiere Pro, it's going to record Premiere Pro. Um, whatever I open up on my desktop. I have multiple screens. You may or may not. If you're just working on, say, a Chromebook or uh, a laptop that this runs on, um, it just depends on the program you're using. Uh, once again, I hope this tutorial was helpful. Um, we're trying some new things and some different things. Um, if you want to get out of just using, say, Google Meet and, and Zoom, and you want to share some videos of you actually going through the process or PowerPoints or maybe even websites, uh, let me know if you've got any questions or ideas for other tutorials. Um, you can email me uh, or comment. Thanks.